You share 50% of this stuff with this, which, if my calculations are correct, means you're a banana. I'm a banana? Everything is bananas? You see, this little factoid came from the National Human Genome Research Institute, which said that human and banana DNA is about 50% similar. But like, does that mean we're bananas? Let's name some things that humans and bananas have in common. Great source of potassium, soft but tough exterior with a more gooey interior, naturally radioactive, easy to eat. The list goes on. So I guess we're a sentient banana super race? To get to the bottom of this, let's crack open a cold, hard, moist can of science. DNA is basically like the blueprint to a home. Humans and bananas have some things in common on this blueprint. Skin that can be peeled, gross tough bits on both ends, born connected to the other the same thing until somebody chops us off. But at the end of the day, we look pretty different. The other part of this is what our genes look like. In the case of genes, humans and bananas are pretty different. If bananas were a pair of jorts, humans would be like a three-piece jean suit. Humans and bananas only share about 2% of the same genes, which are essentially the portions of the DNA that actually do the building of the blueprints. But at the end of the day, humans are 50% banana. But we're also 50% of a lot of things, and I think it's time we adopt this truth to be more central to our reality, and that can really only mean one thing. <laughs> <laughs>